March 20. Um, it's about 8.15 a.m. and I have my IELTS test in five hours. So, as you might remember from my previous videos, I took my IELTS test back in March 2019 and now it is expired. Continuing to be an IELTS trainer with an expired TRF, uh, it just didn't feel right. So I booked my computer delivered IELTS exam on March 20th, today. My voice is always windy and fucked up in the morning. Anyway. Let's work out. You think you know me? Say I'm as cold hearted as they come. You think I'm slowly cutting my ties with you that I'm done. Finally, starting to break out some sweat. Here's what you don't know. Twenty-five minutes in, five minutes left. I feel great. Now I can feel it. Now I believe it. Baby, tonight is the night. I'm gonna call you up in the name of love. Last fifty seconds, last one hundred drop jumps. Working out in the morning does two things. It wakes you up like nothing else and it makes you take the right decisions throughout the day. I think I'm running a bit late, but I'm famished. So I'm gonna have some breakfast. I have to print out the acknowledgement. We're leaving. So we are here to pick up Neha. She's my ex-colleague and my friend and uh, we booked the exam together. And my brother's been kind enough to pick and drop us at the examination center. I'm smiling. Say hello to my total of 293 subscribers. Hello 293 subscribers. Hi Neha. Hello. Hello. Neha, welcome to my first vlog. Uh, tell us about your IELTS speaking experience. So introduction, what was the introduction? First question was what work do you do okay. and then they talked about my uh, work experience and everything what mm -hmm. encouraged me to do that job Why are you and so formal? No 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 So they also asked me about whether I'm working or whether I'm a student and then I told her that I'm working uh, in the family business and then she was asking me what are the good things about this business what are the bad things and what I like and dislike and then my cue card topic was what uh, talk about a profession which is uh, the most suitable for you what was yours mine was talk about a thing that you recently bought and I talked about a bicycle for my father you talked about <laughs> a bicycle. you talked about buying a bicycle for your father yeah bicycle for your father yes. <laughs> did you really did you really yes are you kidding me which one uh, the one on which you can uh, go on the ride oh <laughs> that bicycle
bicycle. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> I think she asked me about twenty questions, follow-up questions. Twenty? Yeah. My she asked me only five or six. Five or six? No. Huh? Mine was twenty around twenty. That's a lot of follow up, yeah. following up. Yes. Shed some light on the questions. Uh, like, uh, how long would it take for people if they shop online? Hmm. Does it save time? Hmm. How is it convenient? Okay. How is it reasonable? Because I was giving such reasons, and she was after every question she was asking why. Oh. Although I was covering it. You know what? I have only attempted one essay and one letter. Uh, as practice, mm -hmm. and I only attempted two listenings. In one, I scored 7.5 bands, and the, in the mm -hmm. other one, I scored nine bands. I did not attempt any My reading at all. My maximum was 7.5 in listening, and I was making very silly mistakes. That's not no no no. You had 35 out of 40 correct, right? 35 that's, out of 40, but your that's eight bands. That's not 7.5. Okay, maximum eight, but I want to score nine in listening. You don't listen. You speak. What was your score in listening, Satyajit? 8.5. 8.5? In <laughs> listening, yes. Okay. Then we will come So we are stopping at Barista. Some of us need to pee. Do you need to pee? No. Bye bye. We are ready. Get set. Go. What are you so excited about? Exam. Okay. I want to send a positive vibe so that positive things comes to us. Okay. Hyperventilation over here, Manu. Hyperventilation. I know I didn't pronounce it right. You don't have to rub it in my face. Hyperventilation over here. Oh, body knee over here. Okay. So there's the building. The okay. IDP center. Fuck, my hands are shivering. I know you can't tell. There it is. I'm not, you know, I don't have a zoom lens, but that's IDP IELTS, and that's where we have to take the exam. <sighs> Wish us luck, brother. Good luck, brother. Don't go to the gym without me. I will definitely. Tell Dalie. Hello. Okay, the exam is done. So. How was it? It was good. Reading was very easy. I am happy about yeah, it. Yeah, reading was easy. Even listening was listening. easy. I think I think I'll be able to score at least eight point five in listening. Maybe in reading as well. I don't want I don't to know. discuss listening answers. I'm keeping my fingers crossed.